the CQ has a built-in class-compliant USB audio interface and can be connected to a Windows or Mac computer as well as many tablets or phones for recording and streaming audio. The interface has two modes, multi-track to record each channel individually to a DAW or stereo for simple recording or streaming. For multi-track playback, go to the config screen and in the USB SD Bluetooth tab, select USB SD. At the bottom left, switch the mode to multi-track and select a sample rate. For best results, this should match the sample rate in your DAW or application being used for playback. Next, if using Windows, install the driver, which is available to download from allen-heath.com. This allows the Windows system and any applications to see the CQ as a system audio device, but also for professional audio applications to access the CQ via ASIO. If you're using a Mac or a device that supports class compliant audio, no driver is required. Now connect the CQ to your device using a USB cable and it will show up as an available multi-track input and output option in your DAW. Use the DAW to route signals to different channels on the CQ. For example, to send a signal to CQ input channel 9, send the signal from the DAW to output 9. Then on the CQ, go to the config input screen and switch any channels you want to use for playback to be sourced from USB SD, either individually or using the multi-select feature. You can also switch input source in the preamp section of a complete channel, which is required if you want to make use of the Bluetooth channel or if you just want to check which USB channel goes to that input. After switching, you'll notice that all preamp controls have been replaced with a trim control because there is no preamp connected. Aside from this, you can now use the input channel in the same way as you would with an analog input, applying processing and effects and sending to outputs.